aces. The uh, ace of spades has a reputation of being the dominant card. It's uh, sometimes known by gypsies and fortune tellers as a dark card. We'll put that to the test a bit later. We also need 12 in different cards. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 in different cards. Ladies and gentlemen, four aces. 12 in different cards. Let me show you the faces of each of these cards. That's one, two, three random cards. They go here. Another one, two, three cards. They go there. That's one, that's two, that's three, a 10, a nine, and a six. They go here, and you guys are good at memory. Look, we have a seven, a three, and an eight. That's a seven, a three, and an eight. And it's traditional, of course, to place an ace on top of each packet. Let me ask you a question. Are you ready to begin? Actually, I'm ready to finish because you see over here, there's no ace. There's no ace there, no ace there, no ace there. That's because over here, we have the one, two, three, four aces. None of the routines use gaffs or gizmos, just easy slides that you can do.